everybody, welcome back to the Falcon Nation. In today's episode, we are going to be checking on the screaming death that is right there. Uh, hopefully, everything should go well from there. You really haven't seen... Here's Darklight. She's same. But you just haven't seen Spike in a while. Or haven't seen really how big he is. He is massive. He is the biggest natter I've ever seen. Look how big he is. He's massive. That's insane. So let's take him on a little fly because it's been a while since we've been on him. So, um, there's another black natter here just for comparisons. Look at the black natter. Look at my natter compared to him. Holy, this guy is big. Let's just go and uh, show you a little bit of stuff that happened. As you saw, the tower's still there. Spike's a little baby. He's going to be big, too. Oops, sorry, Spike. Here, let's bring you right here, and then you can stay there. I do want to check on the screaming death, guys. So let me just make Spike sit, and um, let's check on him. Uh, we are going to go down there, which is... Uh, you're probably wondering, why am I going to go down there? Um, because it's very risky. But I'm going to down there just to make sure he's still there. Because I read books about screaming deaths and how they love to dig through islands. So, I'm hoping he did not dig out. But he might have. So that's why. And we also have a sign so no one else goes down here. So... It's not the best, but it's good enough. So let's quickly just sneak down to the bottom of this here. And if he is here, I think he should be... Yeah, he should be right here. Oh, my. I don't remember that. I don't remember this being here. This is where he was last time. Oh, no. Oh no, guys. Oh no. It's not here. Oh no. Oh no. This is not good at all. Alright, so that's very bad. Spike, can you come down just for a little second? I need to take you on a fly. Uh, so the screaming death got out. Um, he got out right here in the forest, so, um, he dug right through it. So, you guys still haven't voted for the Dragon Home area to be here or in Area 2, so make sure you guys, you guys go do that. Um, I'm guessing he may have went that way, but, but before we go looking, I guess... Um, time to show you guys new things that I've been, I'm going to be working on. I definitely will be working on this, a big building here, a new house here that I'm going to be doing for myself. I'm going to be building a village area right here for my town because it's pretty small right now. And, um, you just have to pick if this is the dragon area or if the other places because they're both pretty good areas and um and then once you do that i'm gonna ask specific questions what should i build in those areas so think about what i can do in both areas because even though they are very far apart um you can definitely do it so I'm surprised how uh, fast this guy is going. He is a huge natter. Um, I think something flew this way. The only reason I do is because you would remember if you watched the last, uh, the last nation we had, which got brutally attacked by the volcanic nation. Uh, we had a. Split in half tree. Like the tree was absolutely split in half. And one day we actually figured out it was a screaming death. And look here. Oh 
all these trees are split. So I'm thinking he might be here. So, hmm. Might be somewhere around here. So far, I don't really see any remnants of one. But they do love hiding in the floor. So, if we are to find one, it must be over here somewhere, right? What? Did I just see something there? I saw something. Oh! Okay. Never mind. Okay, it's a cave, it has lights, or glowstone, which means it's a dragon, it has lava, this is looking good, but also bad, ha okay, so there's a giant hole here, so that's probably his main win and get in and out, I guess, so gotta go down here. Okay, down here, down here. He's not here. We have to be careful. Don't really know where he is. And I think, yes, it goes down here, so. Okay, so that's a giant pit of lava. So this is obviously not the friendliest screaming death of them all. Oh my gosh, cannot fall into that lava. Okay, so what we're gonna hopefully do. Yes, we landed there. Okay, so now we gotta go here and then here. Okay, oh my goodness. It's a very small pit of lava that leads there. So let's quickly just go see if he's in here. So I'll be right back with you in a second. Is he here? Somewhere over here? Alright everyone, I don't see anything. What is that? Is that a wing? Ow! Lava. It burns. Okay. Don't want to make too much of a wreck. Because he might be there. Also, that might just be a dead dragon that he could have taken out. So. It doesn't look like it. It's moving. It's a screaming death. Um. So we're gonna have to lure him out. Um. Oh my! Oh! 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 Oh, it hurts. Oh, burns. Burn. Burns, 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 burns. Don't burn me. Come on, give it up. Give it up. Give it up. No. Okay. No! Okay. No worries. No worries. Don't worry, guys. I'll be right back. Alright, everyone. I've spotted the screaming death. Um, really didn't matter that I fell into lava. Because all I needed to do was get back here. And don't worry, I'm fine. But it does look like he's asleep. So perfect time to set a trap. See, my lytra is not on. I'm probably going to put these on. But if I fall into the lava, it's going to be really bad. Ow! Ow! All right. All right, everyone, we have made it out of that parkour thing back down there. Now, we just have to get out of here with our life and set up a trap at his main door dash entry. It is the middle of the night, so uh, I'm going to have to take, uh, if we go get Spike to come back. Spike. Here, let's get him over here. Ooh. Well, hello there, Spike. Right, so what we're going to need you to do is fly us back to the Falcon Nation. It should not be too far. So, I do remember we were going to catch something. I forget what it was. 
And I know that we have extra materials from oh, that fence. So we should definitely be able to um, make like a cage sort of thing. Ow. Ow. Okay, so we're definitely going to be able to do that. Oh, there's dark light. I thought that was another thing. Oh, and I have a shotgun. Why am I not using this? Gotta keep this on me. Definitely have to. So, we're going to... Yes, we do. We have reinforced iron bars. We have blocks of iron. And we have fish hanging. Which is going to be very good. Especially. You, I want you to stay with your kid. Because I don't want you getting hurt. And dark light is not going to be seen going back. And he's way faster. So, we want to be quick and slick with this so let's get him like a little i guess trap we're gonna put some sleeping powder on his thing is it right here i did not know that was so close okay so we didn't really need dark light thanks dark light for it anyways um so we definitely are going to need some we have sleeping powder so let's just get We'll probably have to go back for it. Um, so I guess I'll see you in a second when I get this trap set up. Alright everyone, we are back. And the trap is ready. As you do know, the Screaming Death is down there. All the way down. I don't feel like going down there again. So you know what? I'm going to stay up here and hide behind a tree and see if he comes. Because he should be... Oh, before we do that, oh, I already put the fish on, or the sugar dash, it's, it's sleepy sugar. It will make the dragon fall asleep, so it's easy to transport and lock up. So, that's gonna be good. So, let's just hide behind this tree here, and then, um, hopefully it doesn't see us. Alright, everyone, I think it might have worked. So now, it looks like the screaming death has eaten the meat, the bait. So now, we are going to be able to go up top and bring him back. So I guess I'm going to see you in a second when we have this guy in his cage. Alright, see you in a second. Alright everybody, the beast has been locked in this makeshift cage for now so it cannot dig out and it cannot fly away so it's pretty good uh, it is sleeping so we can go in it but we want to be pretty quiet we do have a shotgun so i guess we don't um but we have it asleep um but guys should i train or learn how to train a screaming death because that can be really useful for the nation if I should tell me guys and I will try my best and see if this guy is tameable and if if you don't want me to um, I'm gonna have to release him back into the wild not on my island on a completely different island so if you guys want to see me train this guy Make sure to leave that in the comment section below. Whoops, I may have locked myself in here. It's fine. I can break the door. It's dragon proof, not people proof, so it's alright. And this is people proof and dragon proof, so no matter what this guy does, he can knock it out. So that's our new screaming death. Um That it this is crazy because you know what we're gonna have to get specific things if you guys want me to train this guy we're gonna have to get very specific needs look at spike he's checking on his little child there he's good dad he always comes back to sit right next to him there's a lot of nar natters in this area that's what one thing is but look how big he is 
Remember he used to fit in here? He barely fits in. Here. There you go, buddy. You want some fish too? Yeah, you too. I want you to be happy. All my dragons must be happy. And you can fly away if you want. So, bye. Spike, if you don't want to stay, you can go. Alright. You need so much food. Look how big his baby is. I think his baby's the size of me. Is he? Let's see. Yep. He's a little bit bigger. Okay. That guy's gonna be huge. Okay. We have two ginormous natters on our hand. So, also, was this guy the one? No. We need a name suggestion for him still. We need a name suggestion for a couple of them still, but not all of them. We have Rocky and others in here. We have the Sea Shocker and the Thunder Drum. So, the Sea Shocker still needs a name. So make sure you guys leave the names in the comments down below. If you can't comment, I would suggest going on computer, then you can comment. So, we still need a name for a female Sea Shocker, so make sure you guys go do that. And, let me put you in the water. You haven't been in the water in a while, so you can go in it if you truly want to. And then we have the Thunder Drum named Dylan. I don't know if it's... It might stay. I don't know. And it really doesn't fit the dragon. But it's fine. It's good enough. Uh, but one of you did leave it in the comments. So, um, eh, we'll probably be keeping it. So, if you guys do have a better name for it, you can name it if it gets enough re-comments, I guess. That's a good way to say it. Or if I notice it. And I like it. So, Sea Shocker and the Little Baby Natter still need names. So, make sure you guys go do that in the comments below. So, um, you can do that. Um, and I think, um, yeah. My other dragon, which is not in here. It is not there either. It's here. Nope, I forgot it, apparently. It's probably in here. The battle dragon. Did I name it? I don't think I did. Where is it? There it is. Uh, the only reason I kept it in here because I didn't want the screaming death to kill it. So you because it's not stronger than the screaming death. Screaming death is one of the strongest dragons. It will literally dig up from under you and eat you. So this guy also needs a name. So if you just want to name him, make sure you leave the name suggestions in the comments down below. So I guess if we're just going to go on a little look over the Screaming Death, see if he may have woken up. Um, This guy is so scary. Just look. His literal spikes are poking through the fence. That is so bad. We're going to have to put like another fence around this fence to make this guy good enough so he can't actually harm our nation. So that's one thing we're going to have to do. We still can go in because this guy is asleep still, so that's pretty good. A lot of the dragons love sleeping. I, sometimes I have to just give them a little tap to like get up, just like do this. Boom. Oh, no. Never mind. I just gotta push him in the water. And because they can't be spending their life sleeping. Just a little sad that they are. So, uh, let's put you back in the drang dragon amulet. That's where these guys mostly like to be. So, let's just keep them there. And we are gonna give you a little bit of a tap. Here. Maybe if I feed you. There you go. Don't fall back asleep, please. Uh, oh, yes. Yes, you can fly away now. There you go, buddy. I didn't want to punch him because it would wake him up, but he would be mad at me. So you know what? I'm a friendly dragon handler, and now he's diving in the pond for fish. That guy looks a lot like Spike. But he's not Spike. He's a lot smaller. But, do you guys see that? 
Oh my god, guys. The screaming death is indeed up. Holy snap. Look at that. Look at that. Thankfully, he cannot get me. I will not be going in there. Sorry to tell you. Here, I'll give you some fish through the door. Don't want to get your tail through the door. I'm sorry, bud. Get your fish. Probably will give him more fish later. But, leave, make sure you guys leave in the comments section below. Should I keep this guy or release him back to the wild? Should I train him or release him back to the wild? You just got a lot of things to vote on and comment upon right now. Uh, like names and... I think I'm going to build it there because I don't think any of you commented. So, I guess I'm going to work on that next episode. So, and I'm definitely probably going to start a project here first. So, you still have time to vote on that. So, basically, main focus is... Uh, this area, because I'm probably going to end up building the dragon house there anyway, so I'm going to just scrap that. And, um, this area, uh, should I keep the Screaming Death, or should I get rid of it? Um, and another one is, should I, or I'm going, you've got to name some dragons. I'm leaving it, the, the dragons only have two videos left, all of them. Except, who? The baby natter. He only has one. So, make sure you guys go name them if you want to have a chance at naming them. Just go on a computer and name them in the comments. And if they are a good name, most likely you will get picked for thing. But, if you guys have enjoyed that episode of Nation Battles, make sure to hit that like button below and make sure you're subscribed to see when Nation Battles comes out. Because a lot of you aren't subscribed. There was a big percentage of people that watch this video or these videos and they aren't subscribed. That makes me and the dragons very sad. So make sure you guys hit that little thumbs up button and make sure... To never hit the thumbs down button. But make sure to always subscribe if you want. If you like the series and think your ideas can be better. And you can also suggest things. Like in the future. Like what buildings I should make in the future. How I could progress the nation. Um, and you can even leave theories in the comments. For other people to look at. And um, I guess grow the I guess things that can come so uh, I already have a lot of things that probably are gonna come I bet there is gonna be another attack like I know there's gonna be a war at some point it's just a on an it's inevitable to miss it I guess that's a good way to say it I'm gonna throw those bows away cuz I don't need them I have a shotgun probably should have used the shotgun but you know what it's all right um, let me use the shotgun on this creeper so you guys can see it, because I haven't used it once. Hey, Mr. Creeper. There we go. Alright. So, for now, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!